Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Spotlight. I don't know if that got cut off a bit, but hi, this is Spotlight. My name is Neo Tanner, and we're looking at Sonic Infinity Engine, made by a uh, fan that actually is not a fan. And he's not working on it anymore, but I thought it'd be interesting to put on Spotlight regardless. There's a Shadow and a Sonic folder. We're looking at the Sonic folder first. It's essentially hit what he's doing with the boost formula. I'm playing with mouse and keyboard, which he says that in a readme file that he recommends playing with, but there is controller support. And the uh, homing attack works really well for a per This is like surprisingly good for some, for somebody that it doesn't consider themselves a fan of the franchise. They did, they did actually create a very good uh, engine. And I saw some company Johnny play it, and I figured why not try it out on the channel. You got the boost mechanic. No, you've even got the HUD from uh, Sonic Forces. Dang. All right. I oh, mostly went through them. I can't really play it how he played it on his channel. Uh, it's on a YouTube video. It's like how it's supposed to be played. I imagine I'm nowhere near what he probably would say would be the uh, intentional way of playing. But hey, it's still fun. And this proves that fans, once again, seem to have a better concept. Seem to have a better concept of what Sonic can do than Sega themselves can't do. I can't speak. What, it's F to light dash. Yep, it's F to light dash. And there are actual physics in this game. Oh, right click is to slam down. Oh, I can kick. Platforms, they defy me. Spikes. Apparently, there's some robots I did not smash. I have smashed. Sonic wants to smash. Oh no! But untext your green hill zone. It's also kind of quite a shocker. Sonic playing well on a keyboard. I don't think I can make energy anymore. Oh, I got a dodge move. And I can zoom in 
the camera with with uh, mouse wheel. I like how I can just move and it just plays. Okay, so middle mouse button also does the light dash. Oh. I fell for that trap. I do like how when you go into the boost mode, the, uh, the audio distorts. I haven't played forces, so I don't know if that actually happens with forces. I can't coin light speed dash to this. Ah, uh, but it gives me 10 coins. And a free fall animation. And underwater. Oh, I could run on water, apparently. So does this uh, confirm that Sonic is Jesus? Okay. Okay, I think I've shown all I can about Sonic's Sonic's playstyle. So I should switch to Shadow at this point. So give me a second and we'll switch to Shadow. But before we do that, I'm gonna have him work out. Stretch his legs. I'm gonna need it for the up uh, for the upcoming uh, live action movie. In one moment. All right, here we go as Shadow. Instead of running fast, I'm skating fast. It's pretty much gonna be more or less the same thing, only with just different. You can also boost. Essentially, the place the same with maybe slightly different mechanics. Does he also have a light speed dash? Yes, he does. Does he have a light speed dash in canon? Then again, I'm asking about canon when it's Sonic. Skate. Skate on water. The ultimate life form. Jesus. Dog. I didn't get that much air. He also enters a bit of a free fall thing, but he's just like a dive bomb because Edgy the Hedgy has no uh, no skill other than himself. I'm making references to other YouTubers I watch. He will not get me again with these spikes. Dang it. Trying to get the opposite end, but eh. Oh, so double jumping does it? Sometimes too? Oh, 
I missed the one. Now, imagine if this engine was actually used as a game, honestly. It is open source, so it is potential. There, it is. There is potential that uh, somebody could actually use the engine as a basis for a decent Sonic fan game, but. Who knows how far they would get off the ground with that. I do understand this is kind of an unusual thing to highlight for Spotlight, especially since Spotlight is usually indie games, or if I do a, a AAA or a first-party game on, like, I guess on PS4. Since I have a PS4, that would be the only thing I could think of. This is just basically highlighting an engine for a franchise that I've already done a Spotlight episode on well, with Sonic Suggests, which I'll link in the description below. I'll also link to Radical Soda and some call me Johnny since I've been referencing them. Though, if you found my video somehow, I don't know how you don't know about them, but I'm going to link them regardless. They're great YouTubers. <laughs> Okay, so that's the idea of spin dash. But how do I actually make myself go? Well, this is not how I intended it to do it, but okay. Spin, spin dash is with both of these. But how do I make myself go? Unless the spin dash doesn't actually work like that on Shadow. Alright, well... Some nice hair. Well, I didn't break the game like Johnny did, where he eventually got, I think, Sonic stuck. Yeah, he got Sonic stuck over uh, these things. Yeah, somewhere around here is where he got Sonic stuck. Oh. Well, I found it. <laughs> But I did it with Shadow this time. Okay, I didn't mean to replicate what Johnny did, but here we are. Oh well. Alright, well. Good place as any to end it. This was Sonic Infinity Engine. I will link to the u the user's YouTube below. Uh, because he's linked he's linked it to be used for open source. If anybody wants to tinker with it. And he's also linked playable builds, is which what I downloaded. On the Mugen, I think the Mugen engine or Mu engine or whatever. Still, it's some interesting stuff. And like I said, links to some Call Me Johnny and Radical Soda will also be below uh, because I ended up mentioning them. So I feel like if I don't do that, then yeah. Anyway, thanks for sticking around this long to check out the Sonic Infinity engine. I pretty much know Bunny and I suck at commentary sometimes. So I hope I was not that boring. Anyway, thank you for watching the Spotlight. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Shadow, don't, don't look at me like that. Don't. Seriously. Seriously, don't.
That side mouth, though. 